Today I'll be showing you how to change the blades to a mulching blade setup on a John Deere LT133 riding lawnmower. First thing you want to do is get it up in the air with your jack, put some jack stands underneath it, that way you're fully supported. Next step is to remove the old blades. There they are. You've got two blades and just remove that center nut. I'm not sure whether it goes clockwise or counterclockwise at this moment, but I'll let you know. I'm going to do that right now. So I've removed the one blade. It was a 14 millimeter. Turned it counterclockwise with a nice big breaker bar that makes things a little easier. I'm going to move on to the next blade. So the two parts, or two of the parts that are going to come with your mulching kit is going to be this deflector plate and this little side discharge block off plate. I've removed my side discharge little chute like it says not to do on the tractor for insulation purposes. I'm going to leave it off but I recommend that you put that back in place because you know little rocks or whatever could come through this, fly out, hit car windows, bust windows out and stuff like that. Nobody wants that going on. Nobody wants that sort of liability. So the first step of installing this deflector plate is there's a little tab that goes right here that's going to bolt right here to this bolt. And what I've done is kind of put it in place right there to get ready for that deflector plate to go in. The next step is to slide your deflector plate into position, like so. And then what's going to happen next is your side discharge block off plate is going to go through these two holes here, kind of like this, if I could use, just set this down. And get it into position. So yeah, just like that. So that one screw is going to go through those two holes, and the other one is going to go through there. I'll go ahead and bolt that into position, show you what I've got. So yeah, once you've got it all in position, it's going to look like that. You've got your two bolts here, just like I said. And this is what it looks like from underneath. Just a quick shot of everything in position. And the last step is to go ahead and reinstall your two lawnmower blades using your mulcher blades, not the old regular side discharge blades. So that's the last step. Here's what everything looks like from the opposite side so you can get a good view of what's going on. The next uh, most important thing you're going to have to do is make sure that you get these blades 90 degrees rotated from one another. If one is going straight to the front and the back, you want the other one to be going straight left to right. So yeah, make sure those are 90 degrees off, otherwise they won't be timed properly, you'll have all sorts of issues with the mower. So make sure you get those timed properly, make sure you tighten your nuts on nice and tight. I would recommend wearing gloves while handling these new sharpened blades. And that's it, you're ready to go cut some grass. Thank you for watching, like it, share it, all that good stuff. And uh, check out my other videos as well. Thank you.